So just on my way to go see Jersey Sports Day. We've been prepping her this week, so hopefully she will deliver. Um, she's a very determined young lady as well. Let's go see how she gets on. Go on, Jersey! Go Jersey! Go, go, go! Okay, so Jersey didn't quite get the, the win that we sort of wanted, do you know what I mean? She sort of got a shared win, which is still great, you know, it's really, really good to sort of, you know, to, to be up the front like that. And um, funny enough, one of the parents was also saying to their child, oh, you know, it doesn't make a difference if you don't come first or, or what have you, or second or what have you, you know, it's the taking part that counts. And, you know, I agree, you know, taking part does count, but if you're going to take part, at least try to win or have an attitude where you want to sort of win and be up the front i mean we've always done that with boston and i mean boston sort of shows that regularly now when he runs and when he races and everything else but on the same side we've also told him and tri and advised them how to sort of accept defeat as well and that's a very important thing as well you know i mean you know for me through my fighting career you know i, I sort of won some and lost some and i feel that as long as whenever you lose something you sort of you know reflect back and look and how where you went wrong and how you can improve then you're moving forwards you know then there's no loss there so you know with Jersey you know she's she, she it won't really make much difference to her to be honest with her she'll be happy and dancing and everything else like she normally is you know so you know but with uh with with Boston and stuff it's, it's created an inner drive and everything else and you know and I mean with Ethan too you know he's he, Ethan sort of has a very relaxed sort of attitude with winning and and sort of and losing and stuff but you know when he fights it's a different ball game he's all about business so it really does sort of fall a bit into the child's DNA really but you know we're very happy and we're very proud of them all and everything else and they tried everything and that's all that matters so they gave it 100% and so there's no failure in that. So it's Father's Day, it's Sunday, lovely day, lovely morning. I'm off to Birmingham today with Ethan because he's got the ISA Nationals tomorrow with Sean College so I'm going to get a little workout in quickly before um, I have to spend about three hours in the car and traipsing around Birmingham probably looking at a few shops with a little fella but anyway so what we're going to do this morning, I've just had my aminos, so I've just had my recharge. This is a great new product that I've just had. It's really, really good. It helps protect the muscles, helps you recover quicker. And it's got full of electrolytes and full of aminos as well, which is all good for protein uh, repair. So I've had that before I've trained this morning, so I'm not going to start attacking my body because this is going to be what we call a fasted training session. Um, I'm just going to be warming up and we'll be doing some body weight lunges Then we're going to go to some kettlebell work, some light swings, some presses, some pulls and what have you. I'm probably just end up doing it for reps really rather than uh, time because I haven't got my phone with me. So, yep, so we're going to bang this out and I'll drop it in in a second. So, let's go.
So we've just bumped into a really cool guy who does graffiti artist kind of sketches onto t-shirts. So we're gonna get Boston a little t-shirt, gonna replicate his motocross kind of passion and yeah, let's see how it goes. Let's see what it turns out like. So we're gonna try having a keto breakfast this morning. So we're gonna go with a black coffee with some cream, and we're gonna just go with literally some sausages, maybe some bacon, some eggs. I don't think we've got any avocado or anything else like that, but we're trying to keep carbs down to a minimum. So about a whole avocado works out about 15 grams of carbs. So that'd pretty much be my whole daily allowance of carbs if I'm looking at about 20 to 25 grams per day. But um, let's see what we've got anyway. Let's see what I can't with. Keto breakfast. Ooh. Josh first uh, competing in a second. How do you reckon he's going to do? He reckons he's going to do his low 52s. But, you know, that's what he's sort of doing. He's going to see if he gets great enough space, he'll hold off a little bit. Because he's got the 200 later on today, and he's got the relay with Ethan later on. He's a very, 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 very fast lad. So it'll be interesting to see what he, uh, he pulls out of the bag. Team Josh. <laughs> Come on, Luke. Come on, Josh! Uh, 